there, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode here on Passage Skin. Today we're checking out 8 Days Demo, available from the UK store on the PlayStation Network. Yes, this game is not available to the American store. It's a game that the Yanks just can't wank just yet. But it is, um, apparently what came out of was a game, uh, essentially a game jam, game development progress thing that they did in, somewhere in Spain or somewhere else. It actually got it nominated for all the awards you can see below. So, um, yeah, you guys can't play this yet. It's not available to you. What you can do is actually be able to get it from maybe like the online store for the UK and swap across to your account and then play it on American account, like kind of like the, the way I do absolutely everything else in this channel. But um, in this particular case, we get it first. We have it. So let's check it out and let's see what it's like. Let's try it. We get to play as either Wasp or Ghost. Uh, Lola Wasp Cruz, Mexican, 24 years old. Mike Ghost Doe. Um, I'm going to be taking Wasp. I have a wild habit of actually always playing female characters. The Rice Wars. DOD Inc. has become the world's leading private military company, PMC. Its main business is bringing peace to areas of conflict where its clients have strategic interests. Your first mission as one of its expendable mercenaries is to travel to the east and break the world rice embargo, which is in preventing the western upper classes from enjoying their daily sushi. Your goal is to persuade the local military dictator to end this embargo. Start. So essentially I am uh, Contra. <laughs> this is a modern Contra. I've got a feeling that this is what this is meant to be. And that was about as offensive as it was originally in the first place. Let's see if it's any less so. Uh oh! We're going down! Three days later. Right. <clears throat> oh. A knife hits the floor. Let the knife hit the floor. Let the knife hit the floor. So obviously, um, use stabby stabby stab. These guys were interrogating, electrocuting, and attacking, and we're going to make our way out of here. Okay, th <laughs> this is uh pleasant, you know. Nice. Hear him hacking away at somebody. Full health. Money. Now I've got a gun. Woo! I can go silent killing with this one. Hey, okay. you want out? No. Oh shit! Oh no, that's horrible. I thought I would actually be able to like put him free. Nope, nope. Just stabbed him in the chest. Okay. Uh, so I need to find this dictator and get my way out of here. But um, interesting. Ah! 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 No! <laughs> Man! That is fast! Yeah, let's retry that again. Um, I did not make much progress there. I am not going to go running into rooms I don't understand yet. And the guns do run out of ammo. The right stick control and shoot is uh, fairly intuitive, but it's also probably not going to be the most helpful thing to hold, I think. Meant to be money? I don't know why money is not pick upable. There's be a reason why. Ah, uh, one hit and that's me down. That is absolutely fucked. <laughs> right, need to be a lot more careful. Future. At least that's my health back up by one. So you only get like three health? This is um a pretty intense demo. Uh yeah. Take that ammo. Up. Um. Yeah. He runs for this. I time this right. Yeah. Boom. Oh, 
there's actually prices on my head. So 2,000 yen? That's not a lot of money, to be honest. Oh, that's more like it. <laughs> Pick up all of the ammo. Alright, so I've got plenty of ammo for this gun now. I like the machine gun, but I actually think this one will be a better choice. Taking me outside. So should I actually go out the door yet? Or wander around here a little bit more? <coughs> I think it's actually outdoors times. Let's go. Eight days. That's like how long I have to actually hunt down this guy. So now I have a machete. Wah -wah. A little bit faster and bigger than the knife. And I actually chop down trees <laughs> and actually use that to get the uh, coconuts or something. No, no, nothing that elaborate. And right, let's keep on. Need to actually prepare for taking these guys. All right, need to be careful. Ow. Ow. Oh, that was bad. That guy. Seven shots left. That one's got 18, so I'll take this one. I'll take a fair low clip of that one. <laughs> Boom! Machine gun works better. Ah! ah. Fucking hell! Okay. So I think the whole point is this is actually make it ridiculously hard. Ah! Oh! Yep, that didn't work. See, it's kind of partially because of the fault of my controller as well, because I can't do that, um... I can't do the uh, rapid fire and then switch back because of my controller being a bit... naff. Ooh. I need to throw that. Did I? No, I'll take that anyway. Right, so what I need to do is make sure I don't waste my shots. Oh, no! <laughs> that was a waste of shots. But at least I have an R gun. That's a good start. Mm, what do we got? Let's see. Okay. Ah! There, got him. <laughs> that was kind of hopeful, really, because I was actually... I've got this aim horribly, horribly down. It's a... Like, I'm trying to extend my range as fast as far as possible, but it's not really helped me too much. Let's see. Can I just sneak around this way? Oh, there's a guy coming. I got you, motherfucker. I got you. Let's see. Oh, no! I'm getting tracked! Ugh. Got him! Alright, that was close. <laughs> 20, 18 shots. Right, now I'm on to the next room. So I could see the uh, reason why this got Game Awards. It actually is a fairly intense uh, game. You kind of need to memorize where people's patterns are, but they all kind of randomize on you as well at the same time, so it's not... not great. It's, it's like... Um, you can't memorize level patterns, but you remember where the, you're essentially what your screens are that you're on. Boom. You have to make sure you get your shots right. If you spray and pray and miss and then have to reload, it's a bad, bad time. Left side. Boom. I got you. I got you. Yeah. <laughs> I to actually pick up their guns, but I like this machine gun. What? Do I have to work around? <laughs> Jesus, I got nailed by that shotgun. Um, I think I prefer the machine gun over the shotgun, but I might need to switch the shotgun. It's too late for me to make that choice. 
you continue exploring. Like, I, I think there's probably going to be hidden spots along here that I can go to, but this looks like there's some kind of... Oh, this isn't... So well lit in corners, so I'm pretty sure I'm going to get shot at by something. Good. Oh, didn't mean to take both of them. Oh, got hit. Um, whoa! That is a fair amount of gunfire. Alright, so that's all the guns I need to grab, really. Reloaded. Damn, yeah! Popped him in the back of the head. Boom, gotcha. Should I search around here or should I move the hell on immediately? Because I mean, it looks like there's another room here. No. No, there isn't. Okay. Moving on through the demo. Checkpoint. All the sneaky, sneaky stuff in the grass. Man. Ah! No! <coughs> Damn it. At least I made it to this end of the screen. And I'm just going to shoot everything I see. Like, <laughs> I thought I was being polite, but no, I'm just going to murder everything that has a gun! Everything has a goddamn gun! I could have gone through this way and snuck around back, but no. Oh! Ah! No! Ah! Oh, damn it! It's so hard to aim and shoot with this um control system. It's it's not that it's bad. It's just it. Oh, why did I actually let myself walk into that shot immediately? It was terrible. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Ah! This is the fact knowing that I'm actually like only one shot away from getting killed. Yep. Make that work. Got you. Oh shit! Oh man, that was a terrible idea. There's like going to be surrounded by guys. Right, I'm going to need to take the same sneaky route that I was taking the first time. But just with um, a bit more of a gunplay choice. Oh, okay. Um. Oh, shit! Yep, not gonna work. You have to pick and choose your battles and actually only take, like, one guy at a time. Yeah, <laughs> you can't run and gun and dodge. It's just not going to work. So you have to actually like pick out a target. Oh, come on. I got kneeled in the first fucking one. Ah. All right, so I have one health for the rest of this. Terrible idea. Again. Getting kneeled with that first shot is actually a death knell for me because I need to actually be able to dodge at least one. But it's so, so tight. It doesn't, and you don't really kind of move that well in this. Oh, no! That was unnecessary. Oh, shit! 
Right. Down you go. That is a complete waste of bullets there. Right. Let's see. I've got plenty of guns sitting out there ready for me to use. So, don't mind about losing. Just like the fact that this was a rapid fire gun. Oh, shit! Oh, no! Alright, enough extra bullets. No, nope, not what I wanted. Alright, lifting you. Got a couple of clips to take with me. Oh. I'm going to use this the rifle now again. Oh, shit! Alright, that worked. Was enough. Oh, shit! Shit, shit, shit! But no health left. Die! Excellent! There's health. Alright, now I'm ready to rock and roll. We got this. Excuse me, villagers. Are you? I oh, another guy carrying stuff. Oh, shit! Oh, that was close with a shotgun. to find out if there's any, anything else to worry about in here. Oh, that's more health. I don't really need it anymore. Okay, so that was actually eight days demo. John Big Boy is far away and still running the world wide rice embargo. There are more missions waiting for you. Travel to dangerous places and keep solving erupting disasters. From eco-terrorist nuclear threats to anti-capitalist city riots. It's going to be a blast. Lock and load, mercenary. For God and country. <laughs> Okay, so of course you can buy the game. Um, it's not currently available to buy on the store, but this is kind of like tied into the PlayStation Store, so it will actually put you through to purchase it if you want to. But um, yeah, that's <laughs> this has been eight days. Um, what do you think of the gameplay? Do you think it's ultra violent? Do you think it's actually uh, it's satirical message about PMCs and the fact that uh, those damn dirty cheap peasants are keeping away the rice and us first world people need to have our sushi? Seriously, it's a bit heavy-handed, it's hilarious, but also it makes a salient point that pretty much that we go into places, attack for things that we want whenever other people need it more than others. You know? It's got a message! Um, so it's obviously got, that's the reason, one of the reasons why it's actually been given awards for its actual, like, tight gameplay and for its, uh, grueling <laughs> difficulty level as well. So yeah, this has been 8 days. Uh, demo version, I've... There's not much else for me to tell you guys because you've just literally seen the entirety of the gameplay for it. Keep an eye out for this from, was it, Santa Clara Games? It'll probably be out fairly soon. Uh, they'll, they're probably tying up the, the details of it after this demo being released, so they're probably trying to get it out onto stores. This is may probably to give them a bit of a promotional push. So, yeah, happy to do so. Eight days, uh, well worth a playthrough. If uh, you want to see more of this game in the future, make sure to give me a shout. You can always, of course, say it in the comments underneath that you actually enjoyed the hell out of this and you would like to see me raging and crying over the fact that I'm getting my ass beaten it over and over again. If you like what you saw today and you enjoy watching Eight Days and you enjoyed my commentary on top of it, you can hit the subscribe button up here. The subscribe button will actually allow you to see everything as it comes out live here on the channel. And if you go to the list over here on the side, you can actually pick out stuff that's been uh, done in the last couple of weeks, either playlists or individual videos that are recommended to you so um yeah guys look forward to seeing you guys here again thanks very much for watching and i will see all you dudes in the next video bye